and we are back second time today even as, as promised with Darkest Dungeon which is quite classic for the month that uh, we have been doing doing Darkest Dungeon quite a few few times like almost 100 hours so starts to be a classic we still haven't finished a single run of the game partially probably because we haven't done quite the most efficient and or fastest ways to just do the four runs of Darkest Dungeon and beat the game but uh, do also kind of have the uh, goal to get rid of all the bosses, bosses first before starting to try the Darkest Dungeon consistently so we'll see where we end up end up today and or how many expire as it sometimes unfortunately happens otherwise of course would like to remind about our clip contest so take funny or otherwise clips and best clip wins we do actually have a very nice very nice art commission for for the winner so hello there Tiga once again so uh, after reminding of the competition would would uh, then of course move towards the game and start out for start out for tonight so let's see now we also have the bouncy bouncy these electro themselves up there of course their space because the game insists uh, drawing in white white frame uh, or white white screen format which is a blessing and is not a blessing but in any case the game seems to want to draw in white screen format so we we put the kitty there for some extra extra fun so let's Let's see, see then. So we have have an event where you could like entering the ring. You could get ten stress relief from all heroes. Do a terribly care for the arena. So haven't actually ever competed there. This could certainly no diseases, so could probably use. We'll only gamble, let's see. Have we got possibility then to gamble gamble this week. Seems so. Hopefully they will win. Let's see anyone else in need of stress relief. Considerable amount of it would seem so let's let's take care of that first and see how how that that helps us hopefully <laughs> that we we relieve stress already stress relief these are kind of borderline whether needed and the rest certainly need and of course the care caretaker caretaker appears to be also drinking so and what what does he then agree to do God fearing will only pray yeah, fair enough. Then we have the healer. We creep on life, that's not the best best uh, thing ever ever to have. So let's see, they also agreed. Meditate so we do have at least the main main ones with stress issues. 
they do not seem to have any limitations so into the tavern you go and we of course have many slots for drinks unsurprisingly but that should work well enough and having having done that we could see what characters and missions we have available for for overall by the way also if the chat chat can comment on comment on how well overall we are actually doing connection wise it just seems like, like dropping one third of all frames but if it's even it might not affect the overall experience much so chat may comment on connection quality at will all right so at least someone is eager eager to go out let's then see like so by level Oops, we do have we do have quite a few shield breakers, clearly. This one's favorite. Favorite quite much. Level 1. Yeah, because we tried to get the healer developed. Here we do have... Oh, tape, vähemmän tetanus. Maybe we should also utilize the... Sanitarium a bit for some some with diseases. Plus 100 percent food consumed is kind of would consider tetanus the worst problem, but it often removes both the other what do we have here? Creeping cup minus 20 percent damage. Uh, considering it's Arbalest, would would like to not have reduced damage. Put them also in the treatment, as we have part that we are going to going to use some for treatment. And what's your problem? This isn't a major problem, as it only affects healing skills while camping, so it's kind of of limited consequence actually it seems like even even from the statistics uh, connection tonight is would say atrocious atrocious if one one drops like 40 40 percent of all frames it's clearly not very mentionable connection quality hopefully the overall result is somewhat viewable so Fortunately, this isn't either the fastest possible game, so it's like if you get a keyframe through most of the time, fair enough. And then, let's see, do we have something interesting upgrade-wise? Not that much immediately, so let's see what missions we have available. All right, Cove, it's been a while since we have had fish for fish for dinner, as some might say, and we have the lower level characters, so actually would be good to try and level these, these up. And at arms, so can take the front. Then we have Antiquarian. We should upgrade, upgrade equipment. There we go. 
go ceremonial sensor. Looks looks better. And now that we have better sensor, what do you think? Yes, rear rearward bias. I might I might put it highway man. Yeah, it's fun fun with the shooting. So would be. <laughs> Boss, too high level, so won't agree to go at all. Actually, we should probably hire someone as we do not have enough low enough level characters with this kind of a positive problem. And do not either have slots, so actually go into this was the guy, it's a lot of. All I like level one or zero. Yep. We have quite a few of of cultists here. Do we have a higher level like? Yes. So technically we could dismiss dismiss one of one of those. Would like to try and level the lower level Zarik, does is there any difference between Yeah this doesn't have very many trinkets. So we are going to actually dismiss dismiss them to go for a bit lower level. Activity. There we go. Send this one to journey elsewhere. Higher. For we have need of sterner stock. Would like. Would be one possibility. Another highwayman would be nice. Do not have too many. So let's go for. Elusive, lower level evasive, highway man, so we can persistent. They tend to be called elegantly Knights of the Road, so we can go for higher level highway man. Right. And then we then we go go for Another try. No level mission in Cove, and now we have Highway Man available. Tracking shot, grapes of blast, point blank shot, pistol shot. Let's try those skills for now. Haven't tried quite that field before. Let's see if we have any any good. Trinkets. It's pretty good for developing increases virtue sounds. Fortifying garlic is quite helpful. Rare items, let's put those at least for now on them. And preferably not not wipe out then with the rare rare items. All right, and we are good to go team wise. So provision. Quite enough for anti venom, for bandages, 
maximum torches. You can never really have too many torches. And we are ready to embark. Ah, hello there, Kamu. Good evening. The uh, Darkest Dungeon only starting out did various upgrades and considerations and now ready to start out and you of course get a wave. Good to have you here for also for scouting as you well know our good bat, the scouting expert. So it's always great to have you here for some extra scouting abilities. And we indeed have fish for dinner, easy, easy mission in the cove for leveling up the few character slots we still have at low level characters. The smell of rotting fish is almost unbearable. And it immediately helps, as we see, to have the bat along. Alright. Was relief. Positive impact. Natural eye. Sounds good. What does it actually do? Interesting. Let's see. Natural eye. Plus five accurate range. Range skills. Alright. Not not very range skill character, but it is what it is. Then we have a trap. <laughs> that went really well for disarming. Fortunately, it did no like three damage, so it's a bit of food. No fight here. Next room, please. And our mission was explore 90% of room. Alright, first fight. Jellyfish. How does one surprise a jellyfish still remains a mystery, but let's throw some chemical weapons in first. And my touchment on the common. A momentary Better. abatement. Shoot them with the pistol and the breed of them before they got any spells out. Destroy them. And then we can start beating at the jellyfish. Alright, surprisingly good for low level team. Dots, good. Oh, we can heal here a bit. Right, 16 is certainly sufficient when you had like minimal damage. Another right, that was good damage too. Good guys weapons. tonight. Thank you. Good treasure also. Surprisingly nice start when one considers how, how this usually goes. And mysteries of connectivity. Now we are not actually dropping any frames anymore, so. Let's raise a port to that and hope hope that continues as it's, it's never never quite predictable it seems now at least we are doing much better so let's raise the port the connection quality excellent so then we move And we move onwards. Another room and another empty room. Scouting. Excellent. Let's go. There's a room, but let's go this way first and round the loop. Pretty small, small dungeon, so nice. Nice, gentle. Mission all together, extra torch. Alright. The way is lit. The path is clear. We it's require room. only the strength to follow it. Empty. Ah, next. Alright, what's in the crate? Empty. Oh. 
crap, that wasn't really visible. Oh well. Empty. Next room, please. Illuminate. Alright, that trap wasn't visible either. Traps lie in wait. Eat a bit of food. Strong and thirsting for blood. Barnacle crusted chest. Do you think? Shovel was actually useful. <laughs> useful here or such. Yes. Easy work of the barnacles. Alright, two deeds. Not bad. Worth using one shovel as there can't be that many obstacles anymore. Another empty room. Not very many fights here, it seems. Sack is empty also. Great was empty. Sack is empty. Clearly not any improvements galore. Alright, positive great. Oh, adventurer. That's of course useful for now. At least as we are in the cove. Alright, first big fight in a room. Nice. Alright, and since we have also a few more viewers, viewers, and we are actually even now not dropping frames anymore, so that certainly warrants a, warrants a nice, nice wave to all the viewers. Welcome and feel free to also also take part in the clip competition if you wish and see some good material for that. Otherwise. Happy to have you here. So let's then start fighting. Let's try to get some game and first. Can't quite stab them, but we can some chemical weapons on them. And we can shoot them with the pistol. Press the so Give them no quarter. That eliminates one problem. And then we start feeding the cultists next because they do the stressful incantation just like that. And the low level characters are not very resistant to stress. It's like one of the main main issues you have as things go on. You start getting more and more stress tolerance. At first it's like really poor. Like you get almost every every event gets you ten more stress. No need for healing really, so we keep hitting the Pelagic Guardian now, but that's like right as we long as it's protecting the cultist. Feel pretty alright damage like because sometimes then do like about 10 million damage. More, more chemical warfare. Pretty good amount by now. Also, my pistol shot. Four, still very much alright and complete. It's also good because usually the bleeding resistance of low level character is somewhat questionable. Now I would like to heal. And then we keep beating the Pelagic Guardian. There we go, now we can again attack. Again attack the. How is Right. Died of flies. This is so. how a life is taken. We have only one one remaining. Let's fire at them and also some random. Right, all the corpses went away with the grape shot. Of course, like also Napoleon was famous for ending the French revolution with grapes. So Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Somewhat seemed emperor. 
like intention then had demonstrations and then he ended those also with grape shot so fair enough <laughs> all right have you also been consuming the wing challenge like Luna or what might be the cause of that you noodle At least sounds sounds a bit like you may also have been enjoying the wing challenge. But indeed, <laughs> yes, that that seemed rather rather possible explanation. Oh well, the famed afterburner, and indeed welcome welcome to the stream. It's a while since I've seen you seen you here actively, and of course, great to have you here. So let's then proceed the next room, which we can't proceed this way, so we actually have to backtrack a lot. There was no, actually no corridor in this. Very short. So we have to actually backtrack massively. Interesting dungeon design. You have to take one, one or the other track in that part, so then we backtrack all the way. Hopefully our lead man doesn't run out of stress, stress resistance and get a, get a really bad stress effect like abusive with, with our luck. Because backtracking also consumes consumes motivation, so it tends to be that moral drops a bit also when backtracking, but it's been quite gentle, like a few points, so does not yet the major issue. And now we can go and there's also a fight on the way, so we will go to, to cultist brawlers and the shaman and of course we start first version on the shaman. No. Effects, please. Right, that was effective pistol shot. Great shot. Then we start touching them. Right, that removes one source of damage. Shot good. We can probably eliminate the other one. Come next round, let's try. Alright, that was effective. Dagger strike. And then we shoot. Can't actually. Breaks of time, I can't actually shoot that close with that function. Alright, again, good treasure. We have been getting some minor antiques that are also good. Good source of. Good source of money. So let's then keep moving. Alright, we got a couple of air heirlooms in addition to the doors. Sometimes even a, there's even a gem along with the doors. So. Alright, a bit bigger fight and we also get the other other kind of fish. And we have to get rid of the stressful incantation guide. Got first, so some chemical weapons there, way. Right, that was effective pistol shot. 15 damage, certainly sufficient. Can start feeding the fish. Okay, usually a bit more, more damage. Cult is behind, on very effective. They can't use the French rent for old gods, so it's also bother them as possible. So. Graves of time, see. Not quite kill everyone. There's still the corpse in the way, so. 
Right, now we start. Right, that's certainly sufficient damage. And that thing is them off. Considering the low each level so of the overall room. Or is it right, really we are certainly seeing the also the last room. And there's also unlocked strong box, so... 100 gold more, but also another minor antique, which is kind of the main, main event there. Certainly Wonder Room left, and we are pushing luck a bit. As might be again like the collector or something. FPS. Usually, like, you seem to get a bit more dice for like cosmic horrors appearing when you're pushing it and seeing, seeing just the last room after already finishing the quest. This time, no bad luck struck, so. This fight is morbid aspect. This twisted cavernous maze reward seems and almost traversable. Could be some good money. A few thousand with the minor, minor antiquities also. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad at all. 500 gold per item, so those are pretty nice. Not as good as the rapids ahead runs, but not, not bad at all. Right, not quite like one XP missing for level 2. Oh well, at least we are getting positive trades. Right, plus 20% stress versus human and even replace resolution with that. Great. Less resolute we are then. The man is slave to the beast. A deepest moon. And, the beast and it is, is during such lunar phase many residents report shrieks and howls of the most profoundly unnerving quality. Idle abominations gain one resolve level. But bad and it's of course, very stylish. Yes, this is actually in this game and only in this game the mouse cursor issue occurs always and it's somehow related to that it insists drawing widescreen. And actually do not know how to solve it. Tried looking into it like the third stream of this game and didn't really find anything that can do about it at least back then. Alright, that was of course over a year ago when started playing this and it was like the third stream. Didn't find anything on it quickly back then so gave up on it because it's like of very limited consequence overall, so haven't haven't looked into it, but we'll check again for further further times because it's kind of this game does the display handling somehow <laughs> different in any case in addition to insisting on drawing widescreen format, it also seems to be otherwise somewhat different in terms of like you can put it into a window and then it gives even smaller image uh, which is why I do not play it in a window because it, the problem was like that you tried it first like windowed and it caused even more trouble so never quite liked how Darkest Dungeon does, does the display handling but it is what it is but yes we'll, we'll again we'll look into that again as it's at least a minor issue though, not not like the worst worst one there is, would say. So, nice, nice moon. And Campbell and recovered 95 stress, <laughs> yes. Refuses to leave the bar yet. That does sound quite familiar. Uh, had a night on on the town and recovered 70 stress. Good. Recovered 69 stress, even better. Alright, this is is cured. And then we had the event. Looks good. Nothing like 
major. Now we have like, let's see what diseases we have here. The egg is kind of annoying, so more hospitalizations coming up. rabies and the pits, which is like increased damage, increased speed, but lower accuracy both of them, so probably better to heal, heal at least the fits, it's kind of... Oh, the rabies is worse because it removes 10 accuracy, so let's, let's put some treatment. At least try to treat all the of the diseases. Here we only have the spasm of the entrails, which is not the major issue, as also here. And the rest seems seem clean, so... This is dealt with... Yeah, that's true, you can offset, offset the accuracy, like 10% Extra damage is quite nice. Sometimes have kept the rabies, but not always. It's kind of how how happen to feel about it. But as as know the rabies, rabies and the fits are kind of kind of like not necessarily the worst things ever ever to have. Disease wise, you're you're correct as also noted that they can be of benefit, but felt like getting rid rid of them today. So now we have like <laughs> extra capacity certainly for shield breakers. Always have liked like favorite classes, classes by far are shield breaker and abomination so it's kind of have possibly slightly excessively higher those and we probably could still go with the Yeah, we do have. It's not still excessive, so we could actually do another run to level level these up. Warrens short. Explore 90% of rooms. Complete 100% of room battles. All right. As we got the Cove Adventure, let's actually go again for Cove with the same group. Right, two. It's it's actually long. Wow. Yes. All right. Then we should probably consider treating stress first. Like long mission that probably would give a stress effect. So in that case, do prefer to do something else and get get rid of stress with them. We do also have the shield breaker here, same level, so we can actually do the same, but with them leading, let's do a long, long quest, should raise levels for most of, most of these two, think. Alright. So how has Kamupat weekend started? It seems that some of the critters at least went for very spicy wings, so they are certainly certainly having having extra fun in that respect. What about Kamu? How has your weekend been this far? So let's go for the long apprentice quest here. Thirty four should be enough. We do not know about obstacles, so four shovels. Six anti venom and panda bandages, so we can at least use some. Five five keys, let's take and pretty much maximum thoughts is like thirty. Hot seas, please. That should be sufficient. And 
we certainly should get some level level increases after this length of length of emission. These salt soaked caverns and are teeming with pelagic nightmares. And of course if you want want try any custom names a lot like with XCOM also a couple of times ago only learned that you can actually rename also also characters in Darkest Dungeon so custom names are available of course just ask in the chat if you want want named named character and all right we have to complete 100% of room battles so and scouting immediately works when you have to pat along all right that's nice nice design so we have to complete all room battles there's a room battle there so we have to go there all right most probably not interested in the rotten or all right first snail in a while damage is certainly sufficient. Let's do great so there we go. Pretty good damage even. Fourteen. Yes. In a single strike. Very lucky. Unlucky strike for one. Dodge good. The fiend falls. The hoop blossoms. There's only he or <laughs> four. Better than zero. That we can't shoot directly, so great so. And almost done. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Minor antique also always nice to have. 500 100 fold right the flow of other zero corruption torches are now banned all right then we do not use more torches for for at least 10 minutes we'll check the check the time starting now so starting at 50 50 minutes into the stream and will not use torches so probably there will be some moral issues and now have to remember to not to resist the reflex of using torches all right let's light came and or the Aqualite. And no more stressful indentation for you. Not great. Grapes of the fleet. More enemies over them. Right. Was also pretty Destroy strong spare action. Two them. Alright, and more, so let's heal them. Stab. Press the Stab. Give them no quarter. 
to pick it up, so it was just medicinal herbs, minor antique, not really that interested in shape like let's put a couple of food food in and take the shade so we can stack at least some gem. Eldritch Elder, no, not touching it, not with this group. Done, done this room battle, and then we backtrack. And no torches, so we keep getting slowly into more, more darkness at least. And that's fair, fair enough. As, as channel points were paid for that, so. Next room, and we have a, we get extra torch, but we are not using it. Wealth beyond measure, awarded to the brave. Yeah, it's the getting really darker. All right, and still we surprise them. Of course, helps when you have no torches. Poison the shaman. Judgment. Bear Grape shot. Alright, seven and eight. One for damage less and that. Momentum. Push on to the task's end. Right. We have trinket slots for immediate use, yes. Let's leave the heirlooms. Another extra torch. And some of these. Right. Still kind of seeing if can get more gems. Alright, dark, so we are down to 22 illumination level and torch pan is still still on easily. Not even halfway in, so we certainly are running out of light. Empty room. Next room has room but also keep moving. Right, shovel time. And now the darkness holds dominion. And now it's totally dark. Black as death. Hunger, alright. Alright, let's fight in the dark. Acolyte gets it. We do not want stressful incantation. There we go. Then it's more or less for three for all. So you get rid of this less damage. Less damage in the future. Velocity Guardian is always strong, so let's start teaming up on. That could also do the great card. See. 
Yep, that break, that's nice. Stylish ability also with the core grind. Everything. Great shot. Cox. <laughs> Everything like only the corpse look that cute. Bleed. And certainly heal. Certainly heal them. They burn so that they Probably. First time for bandit but see if we can remove them, not quite, but they will probably bleed out. Bandit. Let's just poke, poke at that. So let's draw this damage and then we can start. Well, I'm the Guardian again. Heal, heal more. Alright, back to full health. Shot. No, no. Stab. Very good stab result later. And grave, so that sounds too close. For the team, that was wrong. From it. This expedition at least promises success. Extra shovel. Very kind. And then we have plenty of heirloom. Starting to prefer the deeds to the. So let's take the deeds. Heirloom chest. We have the key. Warrior's cap. Right. Five melee kills. Right, you already had to drink it. You didn't, so you get warrior's cap just to carry it. These are not really worth the effort. Alright. Then we have the down part separate, so let's do that first. Yeah, the, the music changes and the overall experience changes somewhat in the dark. It also favors some abilities and trinkets a lot. Usually do not really choose those because tend to prefer prefer to have more of more of uh, overall overall kind of like brightly lit environment usually. Right, it's been almost 10 minutes, but let's keep moving. We still have to stay in the dark. Courtesy of our good good noodle. Extra anti-venom though we do not have need for that. Eerie coral. Hmm. Right, anyway. Soothing to the mind in the dark. Very well. Right, another fight. Only, only snails and jellyfish. <laughs> the snails are really tough against grapes of face to have a hard shell. Alright, one jellyfish left. Did everything. Such the such the nail. Right, twenty two. That's some big damage for like the five five HP nail. Right. Got. Then one damage only. Right. Executed with impunity. Grape just so the hard shell snail doesn't care much about the grape shot. Right, should have one HP remaining yet. God's good. And Done. 
hit the shovel, we already have enough pride shovel. Emerald is already more interesting. Uh, not really willing to yet get rid of anything. Long mission, so let's leave it at that. And the room. Empty with a nice dead whale. And we indeed can use torches again as also noted. Thank you for the interaction with Channel Points, always fun. And now we can again operate brightly lit as have usually preferred. The match it's is uh, certainly a play a style also if you put all the bonus bonus stuff stuff in. Uh, for the dark, it's viable. Alright, and the shaman gets it first, of course. Then the cultists. Great shot, pretty good damage even. Short, even better. Grape again, so. That does it pretty nice. Surprisingly good fighting for Foolish that horrors. slow, low level low and driven into the mud. characters. A fortune right, not waiting to be spent. Bothering with those final room in this direction. And a room battle with the big guy even. Right, I'm surprised so. Kind of confused order. Let's switch back. Let's switch back. Then we start trying to... <laughs> that was effective judgment. Shoot his gun. Lies and dies though. Again. Ouch, the point flying shot can be quite to break. acidic if it is. Staff them is not quite done, like 1 HP. Impale. Too bold. Return the favor with the point flank shot. Also, pretty massive damage. Clearly, today a good day. To good day. Wow, very nice dice. Punishment, even me. No punishments tonight, seems. Stab the big guy at least, there's a lot of space to hit with your stab. Alright. And getting closer to done, done in that respect. Cursed and pistol shot stylishly. And stab fight. 1500 gold. Bloody fetish. Alright, that's actually. Quite nice bonuses, 20%. Minus 20% disease resist, alright. Name is also minor antique and 1500, so like. We spent a good while. Good while not using torches, so we have reduced overall need. Let's get rid of that pile and 
have more money instead, then we have to drink it, which it's a common one, so it's kind of not yet getting rid of the camping possibility, so let's leave the trinket and unlock the strong pot, so check it out. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. All right, not really that interesting items. And that's the lower part for us, so backtrack time. Fortunately, the stress has been staying quite well in check for such slow level characters with not that much stress resist. There we go. The light, the promise of safety. Next room. So let's then move. Move on. Empty. Oh. Ambushed crap. Bad, fortunately. Right. We still have food to burn, so not taking the hunger, hunger damage and deep up for sure. Right, another room fight. Good. Right, acolyte. <laughs> Dodge all. Stress pulling and days, and that's why I always consider it a priority to, to impale for them. Fancy. Really fancy. Fair action. Alright, that was really nice judgment to move the no more stressful incantation from this group. Alright, that's some point plan. Then we have one remaining, so that is the spear. Only two is certainly enough. Really good for the stress, but a trifling victory. Recovered. Not a victory, nonetheless. Some glass fire gunpowder. Right, highwayman only. Really, that interesting. Deep speaker head. It's a marvelous aura. Let's try with the healer. Like what kind of? Oops, what kind of? Does it give some buff? Yes, inspired. All right. Stress removed. Nice, marvelous aura from the speaker head. And into the next room. Marvelous, marvelous aura with the bigger head. Sounds nice. Again, not very visible trap. Let's put some food into it and keep going. Not really need to camp yet, so let's keep going. Alright, Prowl has been a while, so first of all we do everything to get rid of the Prowl. That's the main danger here. 
That was quick. That danger is now eliminated. Great job. Alright, that wasn't very lucky. Heal, heal, fog. That all On confidence it. is a uh, slow and insidious killer. Antique is the same value and not yet. Giant oyster. I oh, yeah. This was kind of like you could get a pearl, maybe. Could the shovel be used? Yes. Prevents oyster from closing. Only the first test. Remember correctly that you, you could help yourself robbing the oyster with the shovel. Logical. Use a tool. That's of course. Very logical approach. Alright, then we have the side room to check. Carelessness Rap will find no food. clemency in this place. Food into the situation. Really that interesting yet. Right. We certainly have been consuming food also with the hunger several times already. The best that ever. Right, and another fight, so there indeed are quite a few room fights. Like the acolyte. Hopefully no stressful incantation. Nope. Never got stressful incantation out. Great stuff. Alright. Frontman is really getting getting it, one might say. Right, really. At least uh, at times you hit the healer also. Let's do impale and see. We don't quite, quite get rid of that many. Point of there we go. 
and the beast remains. A dizzy Eleven load, out. Body and brain. All right. Welcome. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Going to get rid of one camping opportunity for that. And... Having a bit of damage going to use the other camping opportunity for now. Not going to have Gathered close very big rates and like let's do half rates. Plus minus zero. And then we heal. Heal the worst once a bit. Like wound care for both. Everyone spam, spam the wound care. Praying removed the stress and still three respites, so let's see. Curious incantation. Right. All right, that was good. Generate food randomly. Fair enough. Hopefully, no nighttime ambush. May we find victory. Ah, and we find ourselves in the sound and serpent choke out hope of wholesome reverie. Uh, this is always kind of demanding scenario like camp with the camp with the shield breaker and find yourself in there uh, more or less do think like cream. Where you fight snakes in the desert, it's stylish, of course, like desert rain, but also not the easiest event. ever. Let's impale the snake. Also, blight for snake. Nice. And revenge. Resisted, so plenty of stress. Can't do much here. Tracking shot. There was that stuff left. Try. Venomous tree, alright. Egg fight or not. Really? Like Finally had a use for the anti venom. Well was not enough. Need to heal them Put please, a bit of health back. Now we have a use for the anti venom for sure. 
Injury. Dream, so Find it in no short supply. Right, we could impale even. Let's impale. And only one remaining. Healing would be also nice, so. Refused healing, oh well. Stab. Right, they have one HP left. Twenty-four is enough for sure. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Such exquisiteness must be admired, they say, and so I am made to dance for their desperate dust pity faces for their watery bloodshot eyes. They're cracked. Grinning lips I am not a person to this departs audience, I am exotic wonder. I am a beautiful thing, yeah, there's kind of like trouble with the past of the shield breaker and you get this kind of encounters and apparently we get money. Soon of page that we are for sure taking. We can get rid of some things most probably by now. Shovel is still useful. Thoughts is we still do not need as many. I scale. That's quite nice special item. The tune or fragment would be also nice. Nice to take along. Let's throw 300 gold away and take that. Simmering scale. Uncommon. 10% protection. Yeah, we had like the warrior's cap. Let's just get rid of the warrior's cap and rather take that. in a single file. Do we actually have to put that into inventory? We can't just exchange it in kind of like inventory management limitations. Can't exchange that with the inventory apparently. Confusing. Let's get rid of the remaining and I went on just to get that along and then Change. Ah, yeah, can't wear it that small optical. Seed breaker only. That's actually a good item for them. So a bit of confusion with the inventory. Oh well. But good enough. So let's then continue our mission. It will be a good length of stream with still those rooms remaining. We are 
finishing for tonight after we finish this dungeon. So let's backtrack. And also there's on this one's Twitter there's the vote for whether you what length of streams you would like so you can vote there between one and a half or possibly do one less each week and do three hour ones so please vote vote and state your opinion on stream length And the a minor resistance. antique would be most interested in that, so... Let's get rid of the critical stone and take the gem. Already looted. Dinner as Kamunia could put this nice target for impale, certainly. Everyone gets it and flies it. Nice. One, one, yes, one. Let's hit the fork. Like to get the heal. Heal the breaker. Five only, but better than none. They're going to at some point expire of the flight, so can't stall, stall forever. Hundred gold, all right. Two food is much better. Find quest complete. Wow, it's quite early, so there are no more room battles. Let's continue for now. We can at least get the chest contents. Hmm. 
We still have keys. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require Grand only the strength to follow it. Really poor treasure. All right, scouting finally happened also. So now, there's uh, let's do all fights here. Right, Eric Corral. Let's check that out. Shooting to the mind. Still, unfortunately, doesn't lose the stress effect. Now we have no, so Packs we take damage. Eat nothing. War. Oh well. But nary a thought given to the plow. Almost. Not quite. Empty room with the dead whale. Curio and Faddle. Here we corral. This time unnerving. Oh well, we are not close to heart attack and we won't lose the stress effect anyway. Alright, not too bad a fight. Certainly impaled. Masterfully executed. Very nice effect. Damon out. Or very not very good good dice if he on point blank. Then it will be quite quick. Final push. Nice, nice. Very nice treasure. Now we can throw, for example, shovels out, would say, so we get a bit more money along. Empty as it. And final two rooms. Alright, room battle. Really many room battles, wow. Or, or not room battles, but the kind of like battles in the corridors, like really. Let's uh, see, like how far we are time-wise. Let's let's do at least one room more. Let's see how hard hard fights we get. So a bit more. Right, not not much first, fortunately. Kill everyone, please. Right, I'm flying. Great shot. <laughs> Everybody dodged except the corpse. Oh well. Alright, heal them by nine. Save them again. That was quite good damage. Heal only. Only the deal break. And that's the easy off. It was actually pretty good. Treasure wise, where's where's pushing on? Cold. Wow. More sacks. Empty.
Yeah, the fish fish indeed are quite annoying in the cold. But as you remember also, Kamu, you said once when we got the four fish, you said four fish for dinner and that was indeed nice. Some good fishing. So let's see the last two combat also going going to push it a bit, we might get like something hard, the name of which shall not be mentioned, but let's push luck and see what we find. Still two fights to go. Yes. This is why do not usually fight. Seems always very good at cursing, cursing my, cursing oneself to have have this happen. I said immediately, and then it happens. Let's give it a good fight anyway. We will run if we start getting into bad trouble. This is quite easy in the sense that. That it tends to also expend its own health at generating the crystals, and as long as you destroy those before they blow up, it's quite manageable. Right, that was very little damage for face. No, usually gives much more. Then we need. Crystal. Fortunately, it spends its own own hell that generates in crystals. Let's try and fail for that. Nice. Wow. Not common to get to fly this thing. Kill uh, everyone, please. And I venom. Who thinks we threw that away, so. Point plan, then better than none, of course. Warpal strike, now there's damage. Yes. Very modest 19. Alright, now face no also started doing damage, so some healing to, healing to do. Still optimistic. That we can actually win. Back Crystal Tun. Right, fortunately, Warpal Strike, a different character. Would be nice if the healer got the turn. We have no anti venom, so. Just keep shooting at them. One! That was lucky. Would be nice to have a turn for the healer. Self is that great. Self preservation is paramount at any cost. Alright. We mostly have to be out of that store, so. Let's heal everyone. Momentary abatement. No more death door, great. Right. Would be nice if what to impale. Yet. A devastating blow. Fortunately again war for a different. Set the stage if we get this door, or it's like one cowardice. Balboard, nice. Dead door, yes. Do we again do one templates? Yes. Luck. All 
right change the ability so we heal heal that because they are only one death door. Alright, that last crystal they can generate because they will run out of health. And we get to impale, so that's almost it. Really unlucky. Crystal doesn't matter if we destroy them one out. Fortunately, Blight helps, so. Its particles scattered to the wind. Some Bomet shards, those are really valuable. Moon Cloak, rare. This is one of the things that actually, as mentioned, there are things that give bonus for the... Uh, for the... Darkness. Moon Cloak is one of them. It gives considerable bonuses. If you are in the dark. Not been playing with the, the dark darkness strategy too much, but let's use food in situ and take that. Nice treasure. And there would be one fight left, but do believe that we pretty much used used up our luck for luck for this round of the PRNG unless someone in the chat is really really like in the wanting to see the last fight also pushed luck what it will be say it now or we will complete the quest So theoretically you can of course make make this one push it, but unless you act now, we will complete the quest, so... No, no demands at pushing it appearing, so we are going to finish the quest and leave the last fight unknown. Yes. We already bought the thing from the stars, so the bouncy, bouncy fellow certainly had some excitement. The pungent odor abates. The things are driven back for a time. Unsurvived <laughs> character, when we try to finish the quest, they say careful and Certainly, it was the more careful choice. Also, huge, huge treasure, 20,000 plus the 7,500 base reward. So that's actually like really, really big reward. Also, everyone is at least level 2 now. Early riser. Alright, plus two speed if thoughts are 75. Prismatic calm. One hero per roster. Minus 30% stress, not bad. In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. Crystalline Foki, gazing deep into shimmering colors, the comet fractures can bring sense of peace. I'm sure what that exactly does, because there's the pattern for this crystal, but on what resource? I'm sure crystal port. Levels increased, nice. Left many a fishman slain in the depths of the cove. 
certainly very true. Alright. Shot by stress and let's treat it. Especially removing the afflictions because we actually succeeded at removing a lot of stress itself. Caretaker is still also enjoying some drinking. Very good. And the healer also reached. Other two, no afflicts and very little stress, so no treatment needed. We have 33,000, so pretty good funds also. So, did anyone want named characters? If not, we are going to start finishing for the night so first of all thank you for joining for the second stream tonight we actually did a good almost two hours with the long quest and some extra excitement along the way so first of all thank you for joining and we will see tomorrow again with the calm game and then now it's time to see who we may raid. We should have pretty good raid group also, so let's check who we could go for. Very good dungeoneering and leveled up quite well also. Luna is playing Beat Saber, Nero is playing Mass Effect. Voidbird is playing something. Darkiway is playing some SCP game. Apparently also Skank Dragon Gaming is still playing. Let's see if they are really playing still. They always deserve a raid as they, as they actually uh, stream quite rarely and it's their birthday. So they really deserve a raid if they are still playing. They are, so... Let's rate them. And yes, it's their birthday, so let's also wish, wish them well, of course. There we go. Great started. Thank you all and see you tomorrow. Good night.